Hello everybody and welcome back to SCP-3008 Lone Survivor. You guys really liked the last video, so why am I to not do it? And also, consistent uploads are pretty nice and I've kind of been enjoying this a lot in my own time. <laughs> to be honest. Is it a bit sad? Maybe. A little bit. I don't know. It's, I think it's a fun game at the moment. But yes, welcome back to part two of actually trying to 100% the game so far. Today, we're going to be doing a little bit more revision to the death pit or the shithole or whatever I've called it. Basically, the staff pile. You know that bit with all the spikes? We're going to be revising that because people in the comments last video have been helpful. And we've also got the new name for the base. Thank you to person here on screen. Forgotten their name during recording. Can't find my phone to check their name. But there you go, it's called the tea table because it looks like a tea table. But yes, here we are. There's not really much else to say in this intro. We're just gonna crack on. Actually, no, one thing. Sorry I keep bringing up Batesy. We didn't have beef for anything. I just, I, I just think it's funny that people keep saying that I'm gonna disappear like he did. Okay, we had a little bit of the issue where we did last time where the frame rate would die, but we're back to 60 frames per second. People are also shocked that I managed to get the game to run at 60. Uh, I don't know why other people are struggling so much. It's not that hard. You just twiddle the settings until you get ones that work. And also run the game in full screen. It doesn't like running in windowed or windowed borderless. It has to be full screen. Right, so we need to sort this out because, as you can see, the staff go into the pile and then get stuck because the, well, the pile's right at the door. And the spikes are here, and they're not back there. Although they do just kind of... Yeah. Okay, so someone said put the corpses inside, because then they go in and then they get stuck. Easier said than done, because I... Oh! Ow! Ow! Just, yeah, just throw a corpse at him. <laughs> Bloody hell, the pool cue's rubbish. Okay. It's just... Alright, don't get stuck. Move the corpses out of the way, and then we'll go in and dump them right at the back here or something. Because then hopefully they'll walk through the door if I line this area. I'm just hoping they don't come to this side of the chain link fence. Right, you stay over there. Don't come over here. Because you're going to see the bodies and then you're going to get hit by the trap and then get stuck with me in here and then I'll die. It'd be nice not dying of starvation for once. Finally suss that out. Nope. Did he see me? No. Okay, bug it off. Thank God. Damn, this is a lot of bodies. Bloody hell. How big was the pile in the story? It was probably like two stories tall or something. They definitely started to get it built up quite a bit. Ooh. Okay, it's working. Sort of. Let me out. Ew. Uh-oh. What is he doing? Oh, there's the pool cue gone, and I'm now stuck in here. Just take the free metal. See ya! Oh no, he's definitely coming. And he broke my spikes. Well, this start of the episode is very combat oriented. Ow. Oh, I'd kill for quad damage right now. Thank you. Right, so now that's over. Let's... Bloody inventory. I've got so much stuff, I've broken inventory, by the way. So I need to start actually eating the things I've got. So we need to get wood, obviously, because we need to repair and replace these, because there's not really much left here now. And uh, they're not really going to die as quick. Although they might start wandering over to my base with the tripwires, but... We might, we might use tripwires as the main trap. It's cheaper to make because it needs cloth and two wood rather than ten wood to make the wooden spikes, so we'll probably focus on that. What's the time? Nine o'clock. It's about to go dark. Maybe not. Ah, fuck it. YOLO and all that. Let's just spend some time mining away. Mining away. I don't know what I'd mine it anyway. I'm not sure if those are the lyrics. I should get 
an auto clicker mine diamond oh that's bad turn on a light night sight seems to be a little bit better today actually maybe the it's, it's not as good as i thought it would be you can kind of see a little bit i don't know People always say that they can't see in these videos, and it's like, that honestly, I can't either, so I don't know why you're complaining. Because I can't see either, so. But yeah, I do boost the brightness and contrast so that you guys can actually, you know, see the video. So you can probably see more than I can right now. I can tell you what I can see, though. I can see that I'm going insane, so we're, up, we're, we're gonna sleep. The nights don't seem too terrifying, and I feel pretty safe for these traps around, so. Oh, and to get infinite use of the flashlight, just don't turn it on and off. Just leave it on and then unequip it. Because it will turn on automatically when you withdraw it from your pocket anyway. And it doesn't drain battery. So, there ain't no point. Let's, let's just sleep. I'm, I'm yabbering again. Okay, I slept for a solid nine hours. And it ain't daytime yet. I'm fucking furious, mate. Come on, daytime. Show yourself. I want to be able to see you again, boy. You guys will be very happy to know that I've just bitten my tongue, so I might not be able to talk properly. I'm sure, that's not an issue though. Okay, day uh, seven. We're one week into IKEA, and we ain't dead yet. Now let's start collecting some gas, because I want to see how much that wooden plank can last. You know that guy that was selling it for ten gas? Absolute rip off. And we're gonna, like the fools we are, fall for the scam. Ugh. We get quite a lot of gas. I'm not gonna use it. Well, I might use a little bit of it, but because you can these these have lights now, so you can use them in the dark. Oh yeah, I forgot that was where the pile is. I just realised. Why don't we just lure a load in and then put a wall, and then they'll get stuck? Where? Where are some of my bodies? Oh, ah, uh, I forgot. So staff bodies have durability. Uh, I think at the night they might one of them might got stuck in here and then when they get stuck they then attack like objects that you've placed and staff bodies count in that pile so and they've probably just died destroying my pile which means you guys have to die now we need to have more traps in there to you know counter effect the problem of running out of staff bodies to attract more staff because the later than the days you get the stronger the staff get please make it hold to attack when you're mining, because clicking is so repetitive. That didn't even drop anything. Right, I don't want to venture too far. So we're just going to mine some chairs. I'm pretty sure these all drop cloth as well, these chairs. Right? Well, that's not fair. I can't even reach that. Oh, I can. No, these drop three wood. I don't get this game. Some things drop things that they shouldn't drop. And there we go. Boom. One more set of chairs cleared. So, we need to make string, which needs three cloth. How much cloth do we have? Ten cloth, so we can make a fair amount of that, and then trip wire. Well, at least we can start, like, like that. That looks cool. Hopefully that'll work, because the staff bodies are going away. Yeah, I can see how that'll work. We'll just put more in there. Let's just get more stuff. We've got a guy who's just kind of standing here whilst I'm breaking these chairs. He's getting a bit too close for comfort. Right, I've resorted back to wooden spikes. They're... Hang on, that's broken already. Oh, fucking hell. Right, it's a bit of a hot spot in here. Uh, can you go? I need to place these without you getting angry at me. Uh-oh, this is going to be bad. He just ran out. We're fine. Let's just... There we go. And now run away. Oh, that was lucky. I didn't get hit by that. And I'm hungry already. Whoa. Okay. Die, please. These barrels seem to be getting them a bit confused. Let's just put these in the corner. We'll destroy them at some point. I'm annoyingly, I didn't find someone who would trade metal for anything. 
because we don't really have a use for metal yet, unless we find the metal spike recipe, in which case, very useful. Right, let's eat something, we're hungry. And we got so much food, may as well eat it. Alright, let's, hopefully that'll work itself and we'll get some more wood. This episode is just wood collection. Really? Tell you what, that meat, that XP grinder is hella effective. They just die on inside there like it's nothing. Although they're breaking those spikes faster than I'm uh, replacing them. No, 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 don't come in here. Nope. Bastard. Bloody sod. Fuck. Right, this isn't going to work. The traps don't last long enough. Get away. Nope. Oh no. This is bad. We need to find the metal spikes recipe. Shit. Now people said I missed a recipe after saying I missed them. So... I must be going crazy. I... I've... Oh. 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 Eh, that's useful, but there's no out... Wait. No! You can use those green things as outlets. The big green block. In the... In the trap room. Ooh. We could... We have lots of options for traps now. Yeah, the short circuit needs wires and metal. I... Do we have any of that? Yes, we do, actually. Okay, apparently the short circuit trap doesn't... It breaks itself after a while, which is kind of shit. But it's very powerful. So, we're gonna... Put a load right here, like. It hits very fast, apparently. But I'm just trying to just doing the metal spike is still best. It lasts a long time. Does the same amount of damage as the wooden spikes, I think. And metal is everywhere. Plus, wires are a little bit harder to come by because they cost a bit more. Because lamps. Lamps are useful. Because they provide light in the dark. Okay, we're going to go this way to try and find some more recipes. I need to find the metal spikes recipe. And I'm going to look extra careful to make sure I don't miss the recipes because they can spawn anywhere. And, but at the same time, I don't want to get lost. Although I've pretty much explored the majority of this Ikea now. So, when I say the majority, it is pretty fucking big. Like, infinitely big. Kinda. Although it doesn't infinitely render yet. Yet. This is all new here. I don't remember any of this. Recipes? Hello? Anything? Mate, it's pretty barren around here. There ain't nothing. There's no staff either, which is nice. And I've been here. Because that's the way home. Hmm. I can still hear things dying, so the traps are working, or the traps are breaking themselves. I don't know. Aha! Damn it, hard metal. I think we've already got that. Yeah, we've got hard metal and two... Ugh. Come on, give me a recipe I need, game. Don't be so mean. I think it's literally the last recipe. Wait, do we have extension cord? No, we don't have the extension cord or the spike metal spikes, which are kind of like the two useful things. And we don't have either of the useful things. Lovely. Great. Fantastic. Please? Damn it! No, don't go dark. Damn it, I'm so far away from home. I don't really have a good... Uh, I've got a flashlight, but it's a bit shit. I suppose we can still search for things. Where There's no staff around here. They're all stuck at the base dying, so... Just a bit worried they might break my base if I go back. Oh, is this here? Oh, hello, my diverse friend. Yeah, you will trade absolute rubbish, don't you? There's one uh, where's the guy where where's you want you're the one who wants gas, right? Yeah. Screw you, you're making me use my flashlight usability now as well. Maybe they're hiding recipes. Do you have the recipes? Hmm? Do you know what a metal spike is? Why do I need a recipe to make metal spikes? I, I'd say it's pretty self-explanatory. Uh, uh, phone started ringing, but we found a recipe. S s uh, sil sil silver silverware? For eating delicious meatballs or killing the staff. Oh. Oh. That's what hardened metal's used for. What a fucking waste of time. Hell yeah, I'm gonna make it. He, he needs 15 metal to make a knife and fork. They better be the best fucking weapon in the world. Fifteen uses. F 
Oh, it was not worth that much metal. Bloody hell. What the fuck? That's the worst exchange in the world. Bloody hell. I'm using the torch because you can use this infinitely. Even though it is absolute bloody rubbish, sort of. Uh, you can kind of see. Okay, so silverware is shite. I just I can use the shopping cart with the torch. That's awesome. Honestly, I may as well just find poor cues. I mean, it's the the wooden plank I get. It's cheap and it does the job. It's a bit better at breaking things. Silverware is 15 metal. You know how much metal that is? I think a barrel drops three or four. No, oh, I know. Shit, it's just not worth it. It's that's the stupidest trade. If it was like you got five hard metal for one metal or something, I'd forget it. But that's just. Uh, we're gonna have to find a door, I think, at some point, so we can find the recipes because I can't find the spikes recipe, and all the other traps are kind of naff and require a lot of work to get. Well, I suppose the wooden spikes were alright, but eventually we're gonna run out of wood. I've run out of metal as well at some point, but I suppose there's a lot. Well, it's been a long night so far. We haven't found much. We may as well sleep so we can see things better in the morning. There's no point wandering around in the dark, so. Sleepy sleep for a bit. Well, morning people. Uh, bad news. I think we're lost. I don't recognise this area. And we've wandered quite a bit in the dark. Things are still breaking and or dying, which is good. For XP. I mean, whew, that's a lot of XP. Right, we may as well get some upgrades. Let's get let's get some of the fasting perks. Scavenging, I think, is broken. I don't get how this works because it follows the old mechanics. So I don't think this has been updated yet. May as well get melee master. More health, more regen. There we go. We're now super tanky. We need to eat as well because starving and all that is bad. Right, that's better. We have a bit more health. We can eat. We can eat less now, I think. Did I upgrade the saturation? I can't remember. Pick up some of this whilst we're here. Not literally, put that down. Well, let's wander and maybe we'll find the base. And maybe the spikes recipe. That would be nice as well. Please. Also, let's test silverware as a, a mining tool. Oh, hello. A ball cue? Ooh, two wood. Definitely not the best weapon, but hey, it's better the range and has and it's better than your fists. And it costs two wood. Brilliant! It does actually do a little bit... It does hit harder than at your fists. No, it hits faster than your fists, so it's good for mining. Unlike this, this was shit. Right, silverware is just as bad as your fists and hits even slower. I think I found the worst Worst crafting thing in the game. Damn, two recipes next to each other. That's lucky. Tripwire again. Torch again. Fucking kill me again. Come on, game. Give me a break. Just give me my fucking spikes. Getting angry now. Hello, staff. Are you guarding a fire axe by chance? You are. What's the chances? I'm taking that. I haven't even found the fire axe recipe. Tell you what, that'd be nice because the fire axe is by far the best weapon. 90 uses, destroys things twice as fast, does a hell of a lot of damage on melee. It's good. Yep, typically breaks things at about 3 to 4 hits, and also kills staff in typically about 3 to 4 hits. All round, fantastic weapon. All round, still completely and utterly lost. In today's episode of... Holy shit, I got lost in the infinite Ikea. Would put that as my video title, but swearing is bad. Although I don't really care too much, so. Fuck you, game. Seriously, I'm gonna... If you were a thing, I'd grab your nuts and rip them off and feed them to a fucking dog, I swear. Well, that was a little bit too un-PG, but I didn't say the bad pee-pee words. Oh, we're back here. You were hiding recipes from me. You know what that means? You get the goddamn chop, mate. Nah, you know what? Better. I'm gonna steal all of your materials. These are mine now. I need the wood. I don't care if you're trying to scam people out of wood to, you know, out of gas to get wooden planks and shit. I'm taking your walls. I know in one episode it was literally like, that's a repair base. I'm now nicking it. These are my materials. There, good luck to all you now, you dicks. <clears throat> right, uh, 
At least we know where we are now. We can go back to our base and see what sort of damage has been done. Oh, hello. I was just kind of running home and I've just stumbled across a light bulb. Wow. Still absolutely bloody useless. Hey game, can you give me something I want? That would be nice. Hey. Oh, I wish staff dropped things, but I know why I did it. It's because you can just build these XP farms like I've done and then just abuse that power. But please, I want recipe. Just the one. Hello, home, I found you. Yeah, I just, uh, just had to take my pent out rage on someone, and unfortunately, this guy was the closest thing to me. Well, the base is here, and it's got all its bits still. And let's see how the staff pile is fared. Okay, got a few more bodies. Oh, and I, I can see sparks, which means some of the traps have survived. Somehow. Yeah, bloody hell. Absolute miracle. Oh, no. No, you're not allowed out. Oh no. Oh no, that's not good. That's two very angry boys now chasing me. Uh, uh. Oh, you're dead. This is getting out of hand. Right, we need to quickly repair here so they go here and die and don't come back out again. I know I said I'd stop making wooden spikes, but uh, it's so easy to make. I can't. It, I, I, I'm addicted to wooden spikes. It affects one in a million people, and I'm that one in a million. I can hear some staff coming. Ow! You ass! You pushed me into my own spikes and they killed me, you dickhead. What an absolute ass. Ah, you bloody dicks. Right, Silverware, it's your time to shine. Oh my god, it hits so slow. I'd rather just kill myself. Well, I'm actually going to save because I just realised I haven't saved for two days. It, they're, they're, they're honestly shite. Right, the trip wires did its job a little bit. Bloody hell. Nah, the, the silverware's just terrible. There's so, there's so many staff. There is so much. There's so much staff. We're so screwed. Right, maximum defense. Come on. We're going to have to build a second pile that's easy to access because it's getting too congested in there. <laughs> we filled the room with bodies. I literally can't get in there anymore. Anyway, we're going to call it quits for this video. We've been recording for a hell of a long time. We've really made a lot of progress. Next episode, we'll definitely be building a second pile because I can't maintain that one. It's too full. I can't get in. So we're going to have to find a way of getting in or moving things whilst things are still going in and dying. But anyway, thank you guys for watching this episode. I will see you very soon for another one. Toodaloos. Also, fix the fucking silverware. <laughs>